Hemdale Film Corporation, known as Hemdale Communications after 1993, was an independent film production company and distributor founded in London in 1967 as the Hemdale Company by actor David Hemmings and his manager, John Daly. Hemdale began as a talent agency that helped launch the careers of such bands as Black Sabbath and Yes. However, after Hemmings left the company in 1971, Daly purchased the rest of the company and refocused Hemdale as a film studio. After producing and distributing British films throughout the 1970s, Hemdale relocated to Hollywood in 1980. Derek Gibson later joined the company. Among its most well-known films are The Terminator, The Return of the Living Dead, Whose Ears, Salvador, River's Edge, Platoon, and The Last Emperor. The latter two were back-to-back -back recipients of the Academy Award for Best Picture. Despite these critical and commercial successes, Hemdale followed these films up with a series of box office bombs and the company eventually declared bankruptcy. In 1991, Eric Parkinson joined Hemdale as president of the company and established a publicly traded distribution division, Hemdale Communications, Inc., and Hemdale Home Video, Inc. These entities were immensely successful and resulted in the overall debts of Hemdale being reduced from $110 mm to less than $42 mm in only four years. Hemdale Home Video enjoyed a record-setting run of 256 consecutive weeks on the Billboard Top 40 video charts, with hits ranging from obvious successes such as Terminator to highly unlikely number one bestsellers such as the German-language animated film Pico and Columbus, which Parkinson redubbed into English and remarketed as The Magic Voyage in 1995. Parkinson was instrumental in administering the organization and sale of the main film library to Consortium de Realisation, a French holding company established by Credit Lyonnais Bank. The Hemdale Library was rolled into a refinancing venture for Orion Pictures and Metro-Goldwyn-Mayer, after which time, the remaining Hemdale operating divisions were closed in June, 1996. As part of a management restructuring prior to the library sale, Daly and Gibson left Hemdale in early 1995. The Hemdale Home Video and Hemdale Communications, Inc. film libraries were sold in 1996, with all but a few titles from the Hemdale Film Corporation Library being sold to MGMUA. One key exception is The Last Emperor, a Hemdale production originally issued by Columbia Pictures, but whose rights are now held by its producer, Jeremy Thomas. Most of the foreign productions Hemdale distributed have subsequently returned to their original owners. Hemdale Home Video, Inc., is often credited with pioneering the sell-through home video industry. In 1994, Parkinson was the keynote speaker at the Video Software Dealers Association convention in Las Vegas, at which time he advocated a major reduction in pricing of videos to $19.95 suggested retail. The first two titles released by Hemdale under this aggressive new pricing model were The Magic Voyage and Savage Land. The new sell-through pricing model was embraced by key retailers, driving unit sales of The Magic Voyage to more than 1.1 MILLIN videos and Savage Land to over 500,000 videos. Both titles were listed in the year-end summary of most profitable video releases by Video Store magazine. The company's last new credit was for the Virgin Games video game adaptation of The Terminator, which showed up on the game's startup screen as Hamdale's The Terminator in text on the scrolling logo, despite all box art calling it The Terminator films.